Hey loves, and welcome to Heart to Heart Love Messages. My name is Crystal. If you're new here, welcome to the channel. If you are already subscribed here, welcome back. So tonight I have a love message from your person. I will be pulling from this deck here just to see how your person is currently feeling, how they are currently viewing you and or your connection, as well as any other important messages that they may have for you at this time, okay? So let's go ahead and get into it. Quick message before we get into the reading. Thank you to everybody who sent me birthday wishes, okay? I did see all of them. You all are so amazing. Okay, let's get the first message here. Okay, so the first message we have is I've been hiding this. And there is very intense energy coming through with this card here. Okay. I just got outside looking in very clearly. So your person has been hiding the fact that there's an external energy that currently has their ear. And what's interesting is that you are the topic of conversation, Divine Feminine. This external person is very curious about you. And it's like they're attempting to get your person to open up about you a bit. So they're asking a lot of questions and whatever they're asking has your person completely shocked. Mainly because this is someone who doesn't know you very well. So this is all based on speculation. This is an energy thing. And this is coming through as a very serious conversation. I keep getting outside looking in so the conversation may be highlighting how your connection looks from the outside or this may be picking up on how others who are important to your masculine view your connection or even what their observation may be okay and this is interesting because i'm picking up on a connection where both of you are either really private or you don't share much about your connection with others especially this masculine energy they're not someone who really opens up about how they feel in when it comes to matters of their heart. You know, they're very, they view that as something very sacred, okay? Um, and this is not because, you know, they're hiding anything, but they have a high level of confidence, you know, to the point where they don't really need the external validation. And I'm getting that this person is sharing their opinion of you and your connection so I'm not sure if this is something that your person asks for, but it does feel like this information maybe was volunteered to them. Either way, this is definitely someone your person speaks to in confidence or someone that they really trust. And I'm getting that this person, this external energy, they pick up on energy very well because whatever they're asking or telling your person resonates with them and rings true. But this is definitely something about the energy when you both are together. So right now, if you're wondering what's going on with your person, there is someone external to your connection who is speaking to your person about you. And whatever they're speaking about has their full attention because your person feels that this information about you is 100% accurate or maybe it has confirmed something about you that they know to be true, okay? Wow, this may be a really specific one, okay? Let's get the next message here. Okay, so the next message we have here is, you are a complete mystery. Hmm. Okay, so Divine Feminine, if you have ever wondered how people external to your connection view you, they think that you are a complete mystery, like in every sense of the word. Even if you deem yourself to be an open book, there is a way that you carry yourself that makes people still want to know more about you. Or maybe they feel like there's so much more to you than meets the eye. But as it pertains to this person speaking to your masculine, they are judging you solely based on how your person responds to you. So there could be something about your energy that they feel like it's causing a change in your masculine, okay? This could be pointing to how they move, 
how they think, speak, or just their overall disposition has drastically changed. Or this is how this external energy is currently perceiving things. But whatever they're saying about you has their full attention. Almost as if it was like this instant clarification or it has shifted their perspective immediately. And what's also being pointed out here is the fact that this conversation is even happening is interesting because normally your person has this really protective energy when it comes to you and your connection. So however this conversation was initiated may have caught them off guard as well. And I'm getting that just them hearing someone else say your name or even casually bring you up has them really, really open, okay? Honestly, it feels like they're really digging deep and speaking about things that your person has never shared with anyone about you. What also has them interested is that this is someone who doesn't know the real you. So this is not only an observation that they made based upon the surface, this is about your demeanor, your energy, how you carry yourself, maybe even how you look, okay? And it's coming through as if your energy may be a little bit hard to penetrate, but because your person is a reflection of you, this is also a key factor in how this external energy is viewing you, okay? So this is really pointing to a connection that is very much in sync at this time. And I feel like this is about a very specific feminine energy here, one that this masculine has very deep feelings for, and apparently something is happening with them that others who are close to them are beginning to take notice. And they feel like this is directly tied to you, Divine Feminine, okay? And because they know your person, this is what they're using to compare, like how they were in the past versus how they are now in this connection with you. And so you're being viewed as this very mysterious kind of feminine energy who has had this major effect on your person. And so much so that people close to them are trying to figure out who you are beneath the surface, okay? Mm, wow. Let's get the next message here. Okay, so the next message we have is, you left a mark. Okay, so if you're resonating with this message so far, this is highlighting how your connection is being viewed externally and how people can really sense that this is something special. This is really not something that you can ignore. And where your masculine is at this stage of your connection is in a very, very grounded place. This masculine energy is someone who has been through many awakenings by way of aligning with you, Divine Feminine. And now their soul is kind of taking them through this very grounded experience. So whether you know it or not, you both are kind of undergoing an, ex an external experience to confirm something that you know internally. And your person has officially opened your connection up. This is coming across as, as a really big deal here because they're very protective or even private when it comes to you. That keeps coming through. So this may be for a very specific connection here. So whether this happened organically or not, they feel ready to do this. Ever since they did this, they can now see you through the lens of an outsider. And this is giving them a totally new perspective on how this connection differs from other 3D connections. I feel like this is something your person was always curious about as well. If other people could notice the power of your connection, they're realizing that they absolutely can, even if they don't readily express it. And it's like they're sitting back and allowing this person to pick their brain about you because I'm getting, this is a very curious external energy. Um, they're asking questions. They're even sharing what they think about you. And what's shocking is that Divine Feminine, you're being judged based upon how you carry yourself alone. So they're actually doing this as a means to affirm your person. And what's shocking to your masculine is that they're actually saying all the right things about you, okay? And this is solely based off your energy or the energy that your person is currently in. The way you are presenting 
is as someone who handles yourself very, very well, which has your person feeling a sense of pride about you because they're looking at it from another angle. So not only does this speak volumes of how you value yourself, your person is looking at this from a much deeper perspective. And I just got masculine energy very clearly. So maybe this external energy is another masculine energy, okay? Um, and this is what really has them open. This conversation is giving them insight on how other masculine energies view you. This is what's really standing out to them. That's why there's such a focus here on how you carry yourself. And all the things that may be seen by the eye or perceived with, without really knowing who you are deep within your core. And so the fact that you're able to communicate effectively with your energy alone is what really has your masculine sitting back impressed, Divine Feminine, okay? You will be surprised how much this one minor detail about you really turns your person on. They really feel like you naturally balance their energy in this way, okay? They also feel like you leave a mark wherever you go. This is where this energy is coming from. This, this is what it's highlighting, okay? Not only on them, but literally on everyone. So there's something about your energy that has the ability to touch people without actually physically touching them. And this is being confirmed with the things that they're hearing about you or the things that, or the questions that they're being asked about you, okay? I'm also getting that this conversation is bringing a lot to the surface for your person, mainly because someone external to your connection can really see how beautiful your spirit is, okay? Um, yeah, there's something happening within your connection right now. I feel like this is a very spiritual connection, but I keep getting like this really grounded type of energy where your person is beginning to see the effects of your love and, and of aligning with you in real time, okay? So whether you know it or not, Divine Feminine, um, <laughs> there's a lot of eyes on you, okay? Your masculine has opened up this connection. They're speaking to people about you. This is a new chapter for them. This is somebody who is very protective. They don't let people in. Um, maybe they're a very private person or just maybe when it, when it comes to matters of the heart, they're not readily open to start talking about how they feel and their emotions. Um, but somebody in their energy is prying, okay? because you have this very mysterious type of aura about you um, where you're shifting and you're moving things in reality, in 3D, okay? And people are beginning to take notice. This is very beautiful energy. Let's get the next message here. The next message we have is, I should have trusted you. Hmm. Okay, at this time, your person is realizing that they underestimated your power, Divine Feminine. So what's happening now is that everything you said about this connection or you felt about this connection is beginning to show itself to your masculine and you didn't have to do anything. So this is highlighting what it looks like when your energies begin to align in the 3D. I'm picking up on a feminine energy who has received major confirmation about your person, about your destiny and your purpose as it pertains to this twin flame connection. And this is not information that you took life that you took lightly, okay? I'm getting that this changed your life in a major way. The way that you loved has changed, okay? The, the lens through which you view life has changed. And I'm also getting something about your guides here. They have a very protective barrier around you. And since you have awakened, you see things clearly now. It's like you can see everything clearly now. But most importantly, you can see this connection and why your person even came into your life. This message here is for a very specific feminine energy who has completely shifted from looking at this connection in a 3D aspect, or even wanting to measure it by what you experienced in the past or with other masculine energy. 
And now you're looking at it for what it is. I'm even getting that's why your person is feeling like this. Like they should have trusted you because maybe you tried to express this to them. Maybe they didn't understand what you were saying, but now they do. Because the truth is, ever since you both crossed paths, things begin to happen. Things that they couldn't even explain or even share with others because they were so out of this world, okay? And I'm picking up energy on just the overall spiritual essence of the year 2023. This year is very spiritual. And this is a year where things are naturally being put back in the right place. Energies are balancing. And so Divine Feminine, you're in this place where you are allowing, okay? You're no longer forcing. You're not going around trying to convince anyone of anything, okay? Especially your masculine. And you've learned that your energy creates. And so you have to be careful, okay? And where you are right now, you have faith that everything that is for you will come to you in divine timing. And you also have faith that as you continue to pour into yourself and into your own healing, you become a natural magnet for divine masculine energy. So what's happening is that not only has your person been made aware of your power, but I feel like you have a deeper sense of appreciation for your power as well and the energy that you bring to this connection. So in essence, what your masculine is trying to say to you is that, you know, they should have believed you when you told them who you were the first time. For some of them, they should have believed when God told them who you were the first time, okay? They should have trusted exactly what they were feeling instead of trying to measure it by what they saw around them. And what they're realizing is that everything happens in due time. So if there was a form of delay, especially as it pertains to grounding your connection, because I'm picking up on a very spiritual, very spiritual connection that may have been a little ungrounded in the 3D. This is only because your person's soul really needed them to learn something else before it was ready for you, okay? They see this clearly now. They see that it's all about you, Divine Feminine, and it's always been about you, even when they thought that it wasn't, okay? And this has their mind completely blown. Because what's interesting is that this is a person who may be coming into this connection, tried to measure it by the things that they saw around them, the people that they saw around them, and it just didn't compare. And now what's happening is that that energy has flipped. And the people around them are coming to them and saying, wow, who is this feminine energy? You know, what's happened? You've changed. I feel something different. You know, I can feel the energy when you're together. I can feel, you know, this divine feminine presence raising the energy. And so it's, it's a very, very beautiful thing that's happening where your person is realizing that they may be underestimated the power of this union they underestimated your power divine feminine okay let's get the next message here wow the next message we have is my heart knows you yeah at this time it feels as if your masculine has received this sort of stamp of approval about you okay or about your connection or just about having you in their lives in some way. And again, it's very important for you to know that this is not something that they ask for. This is something that happened organically. Matter of fact, this masculine's energy is coming through as someone who really doesn't open up a lot about you or their love life in general. But the fact that someone close to them felt like they needed to know this information about you has not only changed how they view you, but it's kind of given them a deeper sense of pride in you, Divine Feminine. And it's also bringing them to the awareness that when they move and make decisions from their heart space, the energy is apparent to everyone around them. It can be felt by you and it could be felt by the people that are in both of your lives, okay? And they want you to know this. So there's sort of this fearless energy that they're in as well. And that's, that's what you kind of do to them. You make them feel like they can conquer the world with love alone. 
this connection that I'm picking up on is very in tune with the universe. And the power of you both together is so potent that you couldn't deny it even if you wanted to. People can see it, okay? They can feel it. And I feel like this reading is really highlighting what it's like to view a twin flame connection from the outside looking in, okay? Because I feel like a lot of times especially the divine feminine you go through this thing where you're trying to really figure out if what you're feeling is real if it's authentic and there is there's also this period that you go through where you feel like you can't really open up because it's very spiritual and a lot of the things that you experience especially 5d activity you know the dreams the telepathic communication other people don't experience these things okay and so it's almost giving you a, a higher perspective, kind of zooming out a little bit and letting you know that this is something that's felt. It's very, very real, okay? And this is what your person has been experiencing recently. So they have been given the gift of other people affirming what they know to be true about you. And the energy surrounding the both of you is so powerful at this time that it's very admirable to others who are external to your connection. There's something happening where this connection that I'm tapping into is becoming more grounded in the 3D. And this is important for the masculine energy, but it's also showing you divine feminine how your power creates. It's almost as if the way you navigate or the way you love one another is such an example on how to maneuver. So this may be a connection that was highly misunderstood at first, okay? Mainly because you both got versions of one another that no one else got or even knew. But it was just the norm for both of you. So looking from the outside in, maybe you face judgment from people who didn't understand the source of your love. Maybe they were confused about why you two came together or what you even had in common, okay? But the thing about these types of connections is that you don't choose them, they choose you. And when you cross paths with your person, you immediately know why. And it's not really for anyone else to understand per se. I'm also getting that this is why your masculine handles you in a specific way or was very protective of this connection. Because maybe from the outside looking in, it didn't make sense, but their heart literally pulled them towards you and you to them. So I definitely feel like something about your connection is expanding because it's very interesting that this reading picked up on external energy in this way, okay? That almost never comes through, especially concerning this very, very sacred intimate bond. The energy of your connection is absolutely beginning to spill over into your lives. And what's being highlighted is the way in the order of this happening. It's almost as if the timing is very important. So maybe there was a lot of healing that had to take place individually so that the energy could be communicated correctly. But it's happening now. This is current energy. And your person wants you to know that the fact that this is happening means something to them, especially as the masculine energy. They really take pride in knowing that you know how to handle yourself with them and when you are away from them. It gives them that much more pride and confidence in your connection, okay? And this is making them fall deeper and deeper in love with you. It's like, Divine Feminine, if you only understood the power of your energy and how it's like your person is learn something new about you at every stage, that's why your energy comes off as mysterious not only to external energy, but to your masculine as well. Even if they haven't verbally expressed this to you, um, they're forever peeling back the layers to who you are because you are always evolving. You're always creating, you're always growing, you're always becoming um, a higher, more authentic, more vibrant version of yourself. And it's really, really beautiful to watch. And it's also beautiful for them to hear other people affirm you in this way and to see what they see. It's just, it's beautiful. Let's get the last message here. Wow. 
The last message we have here is, you are my greatest gift. Wow. Yeah, your, your person is about to find out that this is the energy that gets created every time they follow their hearts, okay? In life, in love, and with opportunities. Your masculine is learning about the energy of love, but from a much higher perspective, as well as the energy of creation. And they're sitting back and loving what they created with you, Divine Feminine. So this is a very, very good sign. This is a connection that's expanding and growing. And it's all happening in divine timing. So I'm getting that you both have been following a lot of the signs and picking up on the lessons and working on yourselves in a very, very real way. So if you're wondering how your masculine is feeling, they're savoring this moment. And it's bigger than just this person coming to them and wanting to wanting to kind of know more about you and kind of singing your praises. This is like a stamp of approval from the universe as well. This masculine has very big plans for you, Divine Feminine. And they feel like the energy surrounding these decisions are so powerful that even external energy is beginning to take notice, okay? So they're in this very, very happy, vibrant, high vibrational energy right now. And they may share this with you, okay? Because it definitely feels like they want you to know how powerful you are and the effect that you not only have on them, but also the effect that you have on others, okay? And honestly, it feels like a lot of these discussions that they're having is really helping them to ground their energy and to bring this love that they have for you that is so spiritual and that really has the ability to expand beyond this time and space down to earth, okay? This is marking a very powerful timeline that is opening up for you and your masculine energy this year, okay? And 2023 is really all about standing in your truth and bringing that which we know exists internally into the physical, okay? So there will be much more of this energy expanding and growing over time. But for now, your connection is feeling very, very solid, okay? Very grounded right now in this time and space, okay? And you play a major part in this Divine Feminine by simply utilizing your energy to create and trusting your masculine to ground it in real time. So what's happening is that you both are balancing. You both have really, you know, begin to stand in your power as the masculine and as the feminine, understanding how your, how your energy works together and bringing this together in union. And this is creating some powerful, powerful shifts in the 3D, okay? And this is gonna to continue to expand as the year unfolds, okay? Okay, love, so I'm gonna go ahead and end the reading here. If you resonated with this message, be sure to like the video on the way out. If you haven't already, be sure to subscribe to the channel and I will see you all in the next video. Bye.